Servus Freunde, my name is Jimmy Cage and this is You Carry Me. The creation drama You Carry Me is the first feature by director Ivana Yuka and it tells the story, or rather stories, of three different father-daughter relationships. Its material, the script is by Ivana Yuka herself, would be enough to make three good single movies out of it. So does it make one great one? Well, You Carry Me is definitely long and challenging, but it's also very rewarding and creates a dense and complex emotional experience. It starts by introducing the three daughters in order of their age. Dora is only a young girl with an outlaw father who suddenly reappears into her life. Eve is a hard-working woman who nurses her father who suffers from Alzheimer's. And finally, Natasha is a successful TV producer who is about to bear her first child. Those key characters all have a handful of other people around them and the stories themselves are kind of connected, but only very loosely. After the beginning, the movie tells its three stories one after another, which was a little bit odd at first, but lets you really delve into the emotional core of each of them, while also connecting them thematically. One thing in common is also the almost lack of really likable characters at first. Eves, who is looking after her old father, is really loud, really unstable, and sometimes even aggressive towards her surroundings. Dora's father was always absent, deals with shady people and has a broken relationship with his wife. And Natasha comes across as a cold-hearted businesswoman. But those are only the first impressions and each character really grows on you. The script and the way it is handled is very realistic, very mature, well acted and deeply human. All the characters problems and emotions seem natural and real. There are only a very few things that happen that seem a little bit extreme, but that's handled so cleverly that it works perfectly. You see, one thing that all the storylines somehow connect is the context of a soap opera. Natasha is the producer of it, Eve's the director, and Dora's mother works there as well. And in context of a show that only ever deals with human relationships in very extreme matters, the stuff that's happening only comes across as more realistic. But don't expect this movie to be funny because there's actually very little humor in it. You Carry Me is a very grounded, very earnest movie. But back to the first story. Eves is not a very likable character at first, but you learn to understand her situation very quickly and the way the Alzheimer topic is handled is amazing and tragic. The story only ever gets better and more dramatic and when it comes to its climax I was thinking, wow, we dealt like... 40 minutes or longer with this now, and it was great, but do we need the other storylines as well now? And then the movie gives you Dora and her father and boy was I wrong. It's the same deal. The characters grow on you, the cinematography and music work hand in hand, and what I like most were the tiny little motives that are recurring in this movie. Eves, her father and a dove, a variety of stones that has an effect on the dreams or nightmares of Dora's father and Eve's as well, and other things like that. It's a very complex movie and also one that goes back and forth chronologically sometimes. In its subtlety, it reminded me a little bit of Krzysztof Kieslowski's Three Color Trilogy. So while the Dora part is equally great and emotional, I did the same mistake again. In the introduction, Natasha seemed to be the least interesting character and while already sitting there for two full hours in the cinema, I really thought, why go on and give me yet another story? And again, I was wrong, because that last segment had a few of the best and emotionally most impressive moments in the entire movie. So if you're into slow but deeply human stories, you should keep this one in mind. Don't let the subtitle scare you and be patient for this is a very long movie, but it's also a movie that will move you and shake you and really reward you in the end. And this being a first feature, I'm really curious to see what Ivana Yuka will do next. All right, that's it. Like always, please tell me in the comments below what you think about You Carry Me. Did you hear about this movie? Have you seen it? Tell me about it. And if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up, share, subscribe, whatever you like.